Honey done near, near this is where this is in the school. That is 50 times zero. It's above the big tree. I'm just going to stop following the plane and follow the controls to the twists and turns. And look how quickly it's evaporating today. Very fast. It's near the sun, actually, if obviously. The sun's just slightly higher in the sky from where it is at the moment, so... It's doing 695 miles an hour. It must have a hell of a tailwind today. Oh, I just need to change my position. Oh, God, I've got it's, it's just passing just below where the sun is in the sky. Blinding me. It's almost above the Scots Pine from my point of view, just markers for my own information. Oh, and I've got the sun right in my eyes now. That is a nightmare to film. Above the left, evergreen from my point of view. Getting close to my roof. I'm going to go for a bit more zoom before I lose sight of it. That's 84 times. And there you go, passing over my roof now. Oh, the sun's just gone behind a cloud, thank God. Last few seconds I could actually see something. Right, give me a couple of seconds, I'll show you what that was. It's a Cargo Lux Boeing 747. If my scanner will shut up for two seconds, you might hear me. Shut up, scanner! Right, lost sight of it when it's just gone over Ferno Pelham, however you say that. So I just filmed that section there uh, from when it was near... There you are, I said Honeydun near St. Neats. So I've just filmed that path there. So that was Cargo Lux flight, that one. Um, Chicago to Milan, six and a half hours from Chicago to Cambridge, got another one hour to get to Milan in Italy. Uh, LX UCV, I filmed this one before, 35,000 feet, 600 knots, and you look at the speed, 690 miles an hour, it was 695 miles an hour when I, when I looked, it's changing by a few miles an hour all the time, depending on how much wind is hitting it, etc. Um, and there's a hex code. And let's just follow the entire flight because that is that is really cruising. So up over Scotland, very close to Iceland, over Greenland, over Canada, plonks down to Chicago. And let's just see if we can quickly see what runway it took off from. All credit to flightradar24.com useful website and app yep you can even see where it's taxied from that is just ridiculously good information so all credit to right, there you go brilliant right, time is 4 29 pm 5th of april 2021 thanks for watching bye bye